Hey guys, Anthony 4 before Diesel. I'm not promoting scan gauges. It's just that brand that happens to be here in front of us. But this is the reasons why every vehicle should have one of these. Okay, so here's a perfect example. Obviously we're parked. Um, we've got an engine light on. Engine light. What do we do? Engine light. Well, it's not really much help, is it? You don't even know where to start looking because it's electronics and it could be anything. And there's a whole lot of codes, a whole lot of DTCs, that's diagnostic trouble codes. And that's what we need to know, what the diagnostic trouble code is. So we're gonna get to that, but I just quickly wanna say first, these are the readings I have in front of me on the scan gauge. Now, this is a scan gauge, but there's other brands, of, you know, the EDS is about 70 bucks, but it might have not have the same functions, but 90%, right? You kind of don't need transmission. If you know how to drive it, how to lock the torque converter, how to avoid creating heat, it doesn't help you to know how hot your transmission is, so don't worry about it. Do you know what I mean? Just do the right driving and don't worry about it and change the oil periodically. Now, this is what I have. I've got the coolant temperature there. This one runs a little bit warm. They should idle at about 83. This one's sort of 84, 85 because it's got a new thermostat in it. You've got to watch those new parts sometimes. The transmission temperature, 57 degrees. Okay, that'll be slowly warming up just sitting here because normal operating temperature is the same as coolant temperature. That's why they run it through the coolant tank in the radiator. So it, while we're just sitting here, you'll probably slowly watch. It'll happen very slowly. But as that 57 degree ATF is getting run through the 84 degree coolant, it will slowly, very slowly warm up, more so when we're driving. The other thing we got on the left at the bottom is the load, LOD. Now, a 120 Prado, I've said this before in other videos, but I'll just touch on it again while we're talking scan gauges. The load reading on a 120 Prado with a good set of injectors and engine and everything being in 100% condition, is around about what you see there sort of 10 or 11 now it's gone up to 16 17 that's because the aircon is cutting in right so aircon compressors cutting creates loads cut out now so you drop back to sort of 10 11 10 11 is very good um 12 is fine 13 is good 14 is okay 15 is getting up there start saving 16 and above you need a new set of injectors now that's a general guide. So I hope that was really handy for you, but it's a general guide. You've got to look at the other readings. That's when you're going to plug in scan tools and have a good look. Now let's work out how we're going to get rid of this engine light and try and work out what the problem is. So what you do is if you've got one of these or a similar unit or an app on your phone or a Bluetooth dongle, whatever the case may be, is you come in here and you press, well, I'm going to try and show you without getting in the way. Press the home button, that's that red one. And at the top left, it says scan. So we press scan, one code stored. Okay, codes, what do we got? Codes, P0400. We've got a smile now, okay? We're not gonna say any more. People that have been following the information, you know, you know what's going on there. Everybody's each own personal choice, what they wanna do with their engines and different systems. But in this case, with this vehicle, this happens every now and then, so we're going to press clear, and it says clear codes, yes. So you can call your mechanic and tell them P0400, you know, and they might tell you the right thing or not, and then back to gauge, and we're back as we were, business as usual. See, no more lights, nothing to worry about. P0400, good thing to have every now and then. Hey guys, thanks for watching, if you haven't already, Hit the subscribe button, more important information coming your way shortly. Very soon actually, got a cracker deal for you.